What is up YouTube? This is Everything is Tech here from everythingistech.com. In this video, I have my review of the Mac X Video Converter Pro software by Digiarty. Now, the really cool thing about this software is that it has some features that not all video converters do. For example, this not only allows you to convert your video files from one type of file to another, it also allows you to download videos right off of YouTube, allows you to make photo slideshows, even allows you to record your desktop screen, and last but not least, even edit a video directly from the software itself. But now before we go ahead and move on, I want to take a really quick moment to thank DigiArty for supplying me with this full working demo of the software so I can go ahead and review it for all of you guys. Now the first thing I want to demonstrate on this program is how to go ahead and actually convert a video file. So you can either open up the file from file open or you can just go ahead and drag and drop. I prefer drag and dropping. So here is one of my recent videos that just uploaded onto YouTube. But the first thing you do when you go ahead and the first thing that happens when you go ahead and drag or open up a file in the program is that you get a list of potential output profiles and this program has several outputs preset you can you know choose Apple devices you can choose Windows devices and you can directly use that as an output you can even use um, you know go to music you have all these different output programs you have flack you have lossless and that's awesome because I love lossless audio but you have several you know presets I personally like to go and use the mp4 video h264 bump that up to HQ and click done and then after that I look I like to go ahead and actually define my own presets which you can do by going right over here and clicking that and you have a list of you know options for video and audio so so the app pro profile is pretty much what you just chose then the video codec I like to keep it h264 the frame rate resolution and aspect ratio I just like to keep it original so there's no difference in the quality as far as that goes and as far as the audio codecs go I like to keep that AAC the sample rate 48,000 two channels and the bit rate I like to always have 320 especially if it's a movie or a video I make and when you're done just you can simply click apply to all if you have more than one video queued up to get it converted or you can just click OK. Now before we go ahead and convert the video we can always go ahead and click on the I over here which is for info and it tells us all the information about the original video. Now when you're done with that you can just go ahead and exit out and before you go ahead and convert the video you can always choose how much power the computer uses to convert your video. So over here it says that I can use all of eight of my CPU core use. I just use the whole you know eight because you know why not it gets a job done faster so just when you're ready go ahead and click run and starts going ahead and converting the video. So the next thing I want to demonstrate is actually downloading YouTube videos onto your computer from this program. So pretty much when you go ahead and open the program, it's the third button over here, it says YouTube, pretty obvious, you can't miss it. And then you come to another window, and if you go ahead and click this first link, or the first button rather, it says add YouTube URL, go ahead and click on it, and just copy and paste the YouTube videos URL that you want to download, and then click analyze, it takes a few seconds to analyze it and give you the different resolution, size, and codec available. So I'm going to go with 1920p, which is should be, I think, 1080p because it's 1920 by 1080. And go ahead and click OK. And then we have this video right here. And then go ahead and just click Download Now. And it starts downloading really quickly and shows you the status right over here with a bar to go with it. Now the next thing I want to show you all is actually recording video from your webcam so you can go ahead and click on this icon right here it says it looks like a webcam so right next to the YouTube icon click on it and it will come up this is the window that's going to come up and I don't know so there's something wrong with my webcam I have to fix that but pretty much you can also edit settings here as well so if you go ahead and click over here you have the audio device built in that you want to use to record sound with and then you can also use your video device, FaceTime camera, or if you have something else. You also check on the resolution. And of course, my webcam only goes up to 720p, so that's, of course, not gonna be the best quality. And then, of course, you have all the normal things you'd have, like where to save the file when you're done. 
and if you want to actually convert it as soon as you're done recording and then once you're done with the settings just click done and click on this video right here or this button right here to start recording the video now my overall impression of the program is that it, overall it's a really great program to have at your disposal it's really easy to learn really easy to understand and use and really reliable the only real problem I found using this program you actually need to have the line operating system or something more recent than line if you're still on snow leopard like me I'm still on 10.6.8 you can can't really use the software to record from your desktop which personally for me it isn't a problem but I know a lot of other people that could be an issue so this concludes my video hope you guys enjoyed the video if you have any questions or comments please feel free to leave a comment down below send me a message or even send me an email oh and I forgot to mention one of the most important things in the video and that is that this company is giving away their software for free as a way to say thank you to all their customers if you want to go ahead and grab this program for free go look in the description box below no questions no surveys no nothing pretty much just click on the link and click download and you have the software for free it's a full working software if you happen to miss the thanksgiving deal the software will run you about 50 bucks which again i believe is definitely worth the money especially if you're converting a lot of files this software really makes it quick simple and easy hope you guys enjoyed the video and peace out